What do we got out there? <laughs> Anything got, exciting? Yeah, actually, it is exciting. <laughs> yeah. it, from 24 hours ago to now, we got more action. Make it happen. Hey. We got more action. Okay. All right, I've been working on it. We cooked up another storm for you guys. And Perfect. we're going to go ahead and send it in over the weekend, and it looks like okay. it could be better than the one we're going to get late tomorrow and into Friday. So when we talk about these in our storm report, we're going to talk about them together as one storm. And I'll get to that in just a moment. But as you can see from the metro area, beautiful day today. Get up to the northern mountains. Angel Fire looking down into the Moreno Valley. A couple of clouds slide in as we see the sunset still a ways off and a beautiful look there. Now, as far as what's going on right now, not much. 52 degrees in the metro area. Winds are variable at 6. Cooler today thanks to the front that went through last night. Temperatures 40s and 50s out to the northeast. Some 50s down south all the way across the board, really, from Silver City over to Hobbs. And when you compare those temperatures to 24 hours ago, we are significantly cooler across southern New Mexico, anywhere from 10 to almost 30 degrees colder in Carlsbad right now. We will start to warm up tomorrow, and I know it doesn't look like much now. We've got a little storm system that's forming to our west here. That's going to come through late tomorrow and into Friday, and then another system behind that, which could be really interesting. So here's a look. Storms right now are forming to our west. There's two different ones we're going to watch. So we're going to go a wider time frame here. I don't think tomorrow is going to be a big weather day as far as the storm goes, but Friday through Sunday is when we're expecting most of the action. Mountain snow looks like a very good bet in two different rounds. Valley showers will be possible here in the metro, two different rounds, and very, and I mean very windy conditions, will be possible over the weekend. Bus potential on this is down a little bit because with both of them together as one storm, it increases our chances to get something out of this deal. So here's how it all shakes out. Cold for tonight, cool out across the southwest. Tomorrow, storm sets up to the west, but it's not going to have a huge impact during the day. We'll go breezy, warmer conditions, maybe a quick shower across the north, but I wouldn't worry about that. Then we get into Friday. Storm system crosses. The first one does. Mountain snow looks like a good bet. Some valley rain showers here looks like a good bet on Friday. And then we drop down a colder storm into the eastern half of the state here. A lot of mountain snow will be possible with this. Valley showers across the east and a ton of wind with this storm system coming through. So this one-two punch does look pretty good here to deliver at least some rain and snow and a lot of wind. And I do think the snowpack will get a nice boost out of both of these systems. When we start seeing the snow develop, I think that's going to be during the day on Friday with scattered showers. Again, rain here in the metro area. But as you get up into the higher elevations of Taos County, Colfax County and Rio Reba County, we are looking at accumulating snows Friday and likely over the weekend as well. 50s across southern Colorado, some clouds with isolated rain, and really your best shot across southwestern Colorado comes late tomorrow and Friday. That system coming in for the weekend will probably go too far to the east to be a big factor for Farmington and Durango, Gallup, places like that. So the next couple of days, best shot for showers there. Same deal across the southwest where the chance for showers isn't great, but it is better on Friday than any other day. Southeast looks interesting. No big deal on the first system coming through, but Saturday, Sunday looks better for you guys. Meanwhile, the Northeast is same sort of deal. Relatively quiet over the next couple of days, but then Saturday and Sunday, better shot at showers. Northern Mountains, you guys get both. So late tomorrow into Friday, first round. Saturday into Sunday, second round. Out into the East Mountains, partly cloudy for tomorrow. Winds out of the South 10 to 20. Shot at showers definitely at its best over the weekend for you guys. And then low 60s here in the metro for tomorrow. Partly sunny, definitely going to be warmer. And then we're going to get shot at some showers on Friday. And we may well get another round Saturday into early Sunday as well. So intrigue increases nice. thanks to the new forecast. Nice.